So I finally found a way to never go to the spam folder ever again. Now I'm not gonna be yapping for a lot. I know most of you know that to not go to the spam folder you need to do a lot of things. The perfect domain setup, mailbox setup, domain reputation, email copy, blah blah blah. But let me show you what Salesforce just created to make sure you can avoid going to the spam folder 90% of the times. Let's go. Now most of you will have an email copy that looks like this. You have a greeting, a personalization line your a case study perhaps your offer and a CTA the problem with all of this is the yellow words you see here now the feature that Salesforce has just released is a spam checker feature so what you do when you add your copy is just click this button right here and it will evaluate your email copy to see if it has any potential to go to the spam folder and as you can see here we have a lot of problems so first Salesforce has the detected a lot of commonly used spam words. Basically spam words used by other people, basically spam words used by phishing emails, scamming emails, all of that stuff that bad guys do, right? So, and if you use the same words, you have a high chance of going to the spam folder. So this is the first step you need to fix. You need to fix the spam words, basically replacing anything that's highlighted with a synonym. Uh, then another thing you should also do is add spin tag. Spin tag is basically an alternative word that the email sending software will use so for example instead of saying hi you could say hi hello hey you know and this way instead of saying just hi every single email the email sending software will randomize which word it will use so once it could be hi first name then hello hey first name right and this way once you do it across the whole email the each email you send will look unique to the email service provider that you're reaching out to so for example gmail outlook like whatever right so you want to spin tax at least 50% of your whole copy you'll also notice that it's tracking links images and emojis so basically links and images are kind of like attachments to your email right and any if you attach anything that will hurt your deliverability and can result in you going to the spam folder so you want to eliminate any links any images and basically send email as plain text only there's a option in settings to do that as you can see it's also recommended here and lastly what you have is word count so if you're sending out paragraphs they, they not only have a higher chance of going to spam folder they also won't get read because no one reads paragraphs right basically this will help you understand what word range your email copy should be in right so basically that now let me go ahead and quickly edit this email to show you how it should actually look like <laughs> Okay, so I did a little bit of spin taxing. I did it by hand, but you can use the auto spin tax feature. But as you can see, everything is spin taxed to 100%. We have zero spam words, zero links, zero images, zero emojis, and basically in the middle of the words, word count we need, right? So basically, the email has close to zero spam potential and it's good to go we can send it now basically i'm eliminating any risk of going to the spam folder so just go ahead use this feature it's free for anyone using salesforge and yeah if you need a full in-depth tutorial of salesforge i suggest you take a look here and yeah have a good one